Okay, so, uh, <clears throat> we're here. We're gonna do some shit in Doom. Uh, got a new computer, got a real job, and, uh, yeah. So, uh, I'm hoping I can, uh, do some way better stuff on this channel now. And I'm hoping, uh, me and the boys might be able to make some money off of this, maybe, in the future. Like, like a hobby that generates, generates some money. Not really a business, just like, a neat thing to do that's, uh, still making, uh, making that money. Anyway, we're gonna go through, uh, Knee Deep in the Dead. Probably gonna break this up into parts. Uh, so yeah. Let's keep it on and going. Let's get the pain train going, man. Let's get the pain train going. I don't think we're gonna do the secret level, cause, uh, no. Not doing that. Jibbed him. Jibbed it, dude. Uh, okay. So, yeah, it's definitely been a while since the last time that I did this. Uh, and the first time I did this, I only played through, like, level one of Doom or something like that. That was just to see, um, how well I could- Whoa! Where'd that guy come from? Heh. <laughs> just to see how well I could do it, I guess. Um. So, uh, how well my old computer at the time could handle it. I just want to make sure we're recording this real quick. Uh, yeah, we're recording this. Sick. I'm gonna be using video pad to edit this bad boy in a minute. With my next uh, my next paycheck, I'm probably gonna buy like a, a decent microphone and uh, um, or well, not really a microphone, but a headset that I can use as a microphone and uh, like a headset with a decent microphone. And some uh, some stuff like that. Probably gonna get an actual um, subscription to VideoPad because VideoPad is, uh, from my experience, not a bad video editor at all, um, especially for a free one. There's a whole lot you can do with it, and a whole lot more you can do with it if you pay for it. This is not sponsored by VideoPad. We have eight subscribers. Um, so if you're watching this and you like what you see, uh, we'd all really appreciate it if you decided to uh, subscribe. Me and the boys being uh, geometric, ge geo, just geo now, and uh, Parakeet McGeet, the original three boys. We might be adding another boy, possibly. Typically, I just play with the shotgun, but uh, it's a little interesting to try something new once in a while. Definitely never use the plasma gun, because I like to save the plasma for, uh, um, the BFG, that's, uh, that's what I like to save my plasma for. Let's get back to the shotgun now. We're good win. Okay, let's shoot that barrel. <clears throat> let's shoot these big boys right here. These big zombies. Ow. Saw this guy real quick. Good chainsaw this guy. Oh yeah. Yeah, we chainsawing now. 
So, uh, some sucky thing happened earlier today. Um, I was buying some m mice to feed my pet snake at the fucking Petco or something. And they wouldn't let me buy a mouse. So the first time we went in, they were like, Oh uh, yeah, we don't recommend that you buy a live mouse for that because they can bite your snake. And it's like, okay, I don't give a shit. <clears throat> I don't give a shit, my snake is, uh, my snake is perfectly capable of, uh, handling herself in a fight against a fucking mouse. <laughs> like, oh no, it's gonna bite my snake, what's gonna happen? The snake's gonna bleed a little bit and then it's gonna be fine. So anyway, um, I've been bit by a mouse before, I'm, I'm fine. So, because I've always bought live mice for my snake, or, well, before I had a job, my dad bought them. Uh, I really appreciate that, because uh, I know he's never been a big fan of uh, my uh, pet snake, or uh, really any snakes, but he, uh, he still uh, did a really good job about that. I appreciate that. But so, we go in the first time. And they say, no, you don't want to buy live ones, get the frozen ones for your snake. It's like, okay, no, we're going to the next place. So we went to, like, Pet Smart instead of Petco, or whatever the fuck. Um, and so I might be getting them completely mixed up now that I think about it. And so anyway, um, the goddamn... They didn't have any mice, they were out of them, but they were perfectly willing to give me some mice. So we go back to the other place, and I'm like, you know what, yeah, give me a fancy mouse. I said it to a different person entirely, and uh, he's like, yeah, okay, sir. And I said, if you don't have a fancy mouse, a gerbil will do. And that was probably what tipped him off, like, that's a little suspicious, that's a, that's an interesting way to put that. Uh, <laughs> so, so at the other's place, they uh, they wouldn't let me. We we went there. And I'm like, yeah, give me a fancy mouse. And they said, have you been here before? No, no is what I said. I lied. Yeah, I'm a liar. And uh, and so they're like, hey, you been here before? I'm like, no, I haven't been here before. And uh, so then then he goes over and he talks to the other person who said that I didn't want to buy a live mouse and she totally fucking snitched on me and then after that she was talking to, to me about how oh yeah he's such a hard ass he's 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 not gonna let you get it but I I don't really care that much honestly it's like okay then why didn't you give it to me in the first fucking place and so then we go to the other spot we, we leave that spot because he called the regional manager to say, Oh, this kid wants to make sure that his pet snake doesn't go hungry. It's like, oh, yeah. <laughs> so, so he calls the regional manager and then he comes back he's like, We can't give you a mouse if it's going to go to an abusive home. <laughs> It's like, oh, oh, dude, dude, it's like, it's like, you're giving me this little animal that's at the bottom of the damn food chain, like, you don't actually care about this thing, admit it, you don't care about this mouse that I want to buy, and you just don't want my money, that's all, that's all it is, you're just, you're too emotional about it, you're like, oh, buh, 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 buh. Oh, do I want to give you the mouse, that's what he sounded like. And he was like, yeah, he was really annoying. I don't, I don't want to like over exaggerate um, the guy because that would make me sound like a dickhead. Um, ouch. Ah, uh, shit. Ah, shit. Damn it. Okay, there we go. Cause I can't see anything. I, don't, I definitely don't want to over-exaggerate the guy, like, oh, he was a fucking, he had, the, like, the millennial, or the, the Gen Z pube haircut, or something, because he didn't. 
That would be funny to say that he did have the pube haircut, but he didn't. I'm a, I may have lied to him, but I won't lie to you guys. And I definitely won't lie about the fact that I definitely considered saying that he had the Gen Z pube haircut. <laughs> I was I was thinking about saying there he was with his Gen Z pube haircut, even though he didn't have one. And so, so yeah, I, I almost lied to you guys, but I didn't, and I admitted I admitted it too. So uh, anyway, uh, we went to the other place. Where they were like, oh yeah, sorry, we ran out of mice, but we would totally give you some to feed your snake. And, and we go over there, and I'm like, can I buy a gerbil? And they're like, yeah, uh... And I, by that point, I knew I was really pushing it, like... Because, you know, people think gerbils are cute, whereas mice are just poop factories. And so... <laughs> It's like, okay, fine, I won't, I won't be such a heartless monster in front of you guys. I, I won't, I won't, uh, take your gerbil to feed it to my lovely pet snake. I'm gonna show you guys that I do know how to get this secret level, though, to prove my, uh, my gamer -liness. <laughs> So there I was, sipping my monster energy with my Yankee hat on, gaming up a storm, when all of a sudden, that fucking boy from the Petco said, I won't give you a mouse. It got, it got me into a gamer rage. I picked up my keyboard and I slammed it against my monitor. <laughs> Just absolutely slammed it against my monitor. Like that one guy who's playing a stupid rhythm game. <laughs> and then I busted a hole in the wall. I punched a hole in the wall. I said, to the dear, dear Lord Kyle, this drywall offering is for you. As I sipped my monster. <laughs> For real though, I do like Monster, but, uh, I would never, ever buy, like, a Monster hat or a Monster shirt, or, like, like, a Monster tattoo. Oh, yeah, boy! <laughs> Did you just see that? Woo! <laughs> That's awesome. Okay. Let's get the other secret, yep. Uh, secret chainsaw, secret... Shoot that guy in the face. Secret... Get the ultimate gamer. Secret Gauntlet Legends. Uh, yeah, I played Gauntlet Legends, how did you know? It's like if you play Gauntlet, if you play Gauntlet Legends for the fucking N64, you've like a like a 13-inch cock, guaranteed. I played Gauntlet Legends on the N64, and uh, you know my cock is 13 inches, but uh, it is in my soul. My soul knows that I have that Gauntlet Legends in 64 13 inch cock. <laughs> oh god. Oh no! Damn it! I'm gonna get healed! Okay, he's got hit scanners. That guy was trying to bite him from like a floor now. Man. Oh man. Oh man, you know what, I gotta play Quake on this channel, I gotta play all of those games, man, I, I gotta, there's just too many games that I need to play on this channel now that I have a decent ass computer, uh, yeah, you, you know, you know I'm gonna play some, uh, some real games now, not just, uh, 
Not just Duke Nukem, not just, uh, not just Doom. Not just Doom, I mean, I mean, I'm gonna play some other games than that. Like, I know, I'm not trying to gatekeep Doom or Duke Nukem, but, like, uh, YouTube channel that only plays 90s FPS games in the sea of much better YouTube channels that just play 90s FPS games is not gonna cut it, you, you know what I'm saying? Like, we got Destino to, uh, get that guy to compete with, and I just can't compete with that. Destino is, uh, too much of a giga chad to, uh, to eat for even me, for, for me to even compete with. I can't compete with Destino. I beat your puppet to pull. I shoot you. Ah, uh, no. Get away from me. Don't shoot me. I never did anything wrong. We gotta make Devious Lick Simulator 2021, where you go to jail, you get spent, you get expelled from school, and you go to jail for licking deviously. Guys, check out my new Devious Lick. <laughs> check out my new Devious Lick. <laughs> I stole something completely useless to me. Devious Lake Capitalism Edition. I bought something completely worthless to me, and I will hang it on my wall for a little while until I eventually donate it to the thrift store. Did I tell you guys I'm a thrift store man now? I work in the thrift shop? Well, I tell you what, the amount of wooden signs that we have in there that say shit like live, laugh, love, and I love wine and stuff, which is basically just stoner culture for, like, middle-aged white moms. Uh, uh, the I love wine thing. That's, that's just, like, the weed culture for, for the, for the middle-aged moms. The, the, the whole wine thing. Anyway, off topic. You don't need to buy those. You don't need them. You're just gonna donate them to the damn thrift store. It, 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 I mean, you do not need a poster that says, Live, laugh, laugh, or keep having them carry on. Now, I mean, if you want to get a wooden poster that says, Fish, fear me, you, uh, it's all yours. You gotta like, go for it. Like, that's different. <laughs> that's different. But if you want you want to get live, laugh, love on a poster, you want to get something that says, I love my grandchildren. No, you, you don't do that, but you want to get something that says, Women love me, fish hate me, I catch fish on the daily, then yeah, man, that's that's all up for grabs. Uh, no judgment here. Uh, you want... <laughs> fish, fish fear me? You want that? Yeah, go for it, chum. Go for it. Uh, that's all I gotta say about that. Uh, let's go to the uh, soy cake to come room real quick. Here it is, the Soy Kiktika. Soy Jack. <laughs> it's like... A foolish man... Argues with another. A wise man portrays his opponent as the Soy Jack. But yeah, this is the Soy Kiktika room. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry guys, if you, if you don't know what I'm talking about, it's just too bad. <laughs> it's just too bad, you know? Oh, uh, this level. I love this level so much. I still remember the su it was the summer of 2019. And that was when I played through Doom for the first time, I tell you what. I I haven't played through it all the way since the summer of 2019. There was just something magical about that, that summer. I tell you what. Uh, that was... Uh, those were the best days of my life. Bought my first real Doom game. Bought it on the PSN. <laughs> Those were the best days of my life. <laughs> Alright. I gotta play some Doom Wads on here sometime. I gotta play Brutal Doom on here. I gotta play 
There's so the, the the there's limitless possibilities for me to do whatever I want on this channel now because we're not monetized. We don't give a damn what YouTube wants from us because we don't want anything from YouTube. I mean, as I said, I'd be happy if at some point in the future we'd make like pennies off of this. That would that would make my day, absolutely. Oh damn it. <laughs> that would make my day. Oh fall. Oops. I fell off. But yeah, that would that would absolutely make my day. Um to uh fucking make some uh just even a little bit of money off YouTube. Uh, let me plug my phone in real quick. The thing I'm using to record the audio. Yeah. Okay. Still recording. Just gotta make sure. Yeah, it's going. Okay. So, uh, yeah. Uh. Money on YouTube. That's what I'm talking about. That's, uh. That's my phone, by the way. The LG K30. <laughs> Got it, like, four years ago or something. It's, it works like a charm, I tell you what. I wonder what works like a charm actually came from. Cause it doesn't make any damn sense when you think about it. Like, what the fuck does works like a charm even mean? I mean, it, obviously it means that it works, but where, where does it come from? What does it do? Why? This, uh, this room used to always kill me when I first played this game. Um, yeah, it's not hard to understand why. Uh, as you can see, there's hit scanners out the ass. There's pinkies, which were scary to me. Uh, not really. Not that I wasn't that young. Uh, I was like 14. So, yeah, uh, somewhere between. I played it on my PS3 with a broken controller. That's that's my uh, I walked uphill both ways in the snow um, story to tell my grandkids. I played Doom on my PS3 with a broken controller, and you kids can't even play it's GTA 6. Can't even play GTA 6 with a mouse and keyboard. What the hell is wrong with you kids? These kids these days, jeez, I tell you. What's the matter with them? I don't know. I'm not gonna tell you guys what my computer is, because I don't know. It's a pre-built PC though, because according to my older brother, the PC market right now is dog shit. Um, so I just don't even care about that. I I was like, yeah, I uh, I understand that it's dog shit. Let's get a pre-built PC. Or that's what he said. He said uh, I should get a pre-built PC instead of. Uh, having him make me one, because he knows, he knows the way of, uh, of how to do that. He knows the way of the gun. Alright, so we're, oh, okay, whoa. Oh, Jesus. Right. There we go. 
M-E-T-H-O-D. I wonder if I'm gonna get copyright str uh, struck by the Wu Tang clan. They're probably too cool to care. Method Man probably doesn't give a shit. Yeah, I'm partially invisible. How did Booba die? I'm partially invisible. Bismuth. Okay, right. I forgot about that. Whew. Yikes. Okay. Do 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 do. Yeah, uh, I'm just gonna try to rush through this one as fast as possible. Um, because this video is probably getting long. Uh. I might put some, uh, fucking annotations in the, uh... Okay, yeah, this is where it gets extreme. Drastic! Okay, there we go. Am I gonna die in here? Yeah, quite possibly. Huh. 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 Just stood in the corner and clutched that. Wow. Yikes. Uh, man, I am at eight health. Ah, uh, there we go. Thirty-three. That's doable. Forty-five. That's uh, even more doable. At this point. Get the red key card. I get the red jewel. Ow. I found the red shoe. <laughs> In fighting, you gotta love it. And then these guys come out. I wish you could glory kill to get um, health in this game. Doom 2016's got me spoiled. I don't know why they didn't put partial invisibility in Doom 2016, honestly, because they have power-ups in the game. So why, why, why not partial invisibility? That's my question. Oh, uh, yes. Let's get out of here. And I guess my enter is a little bit wank. That's unfortunate. I was hoping for a non-wank, uh, or not enter, shift. My shift key is a little bit wank. That's jank, but it means masturbate too. At least in my vocabulary, it also means jank, because it rhymes with jank. And because I think it's funny. Say wank instead of jank. Ay ay ay. Okay, so then this is the part of the level where that I'm not extremely familiar with. Uh, to be honest, I think I'm just gonna toggle auto run. Okay, that just doesn't work straight up. I got the map though. I open that, that does, I don't remember. I don't think I ever knew, to be honest, exactly what that switch does. Oh, it must open up this, maybe. Uh, that shows you how much I know about Doom. Okay, right. Do I have a rocket launcher? Yes, I do.
got 52 rockets. What the fuck? How do I get those? Let's just go with uh, this machine gun. Oi. 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 Does anybody know why the pube haircut became uh, fashionable with the uh, members of the generation said? Oh my fucking god. It's moments like these when Jesus' middle man goes from Harold to fucking. I know I said I was just gonna rush through this level and not do any of the secrets, but I guess I lied. Like, just straight up lied. Um, sorry about that, I guess. <laughs> it's just muscle memory at this point. Uh, I have played through Doom Chapter 1 too many times, I tell you what. Uh, I sound like an old man. I tell you what, I played through Doom Chapter 1 so many times as a kid, my damn thumbs fell off. I got the gangrene in my fingers. Ow, somebody shoot me. I got the gangrene in my damn fingers from it. Uh, somebody was tearing me apart with their big fat fucking claws. Yay! Give me the shotgun ammo. I need armor. Like whenever you see a video of a dog that's uh, gonna run out into the, the snow or whatever, and then they just run right back inside. That's uh, that's what happened right then uh, for me. Ah, picked up the green armor when I still had blue, I think. Ah, well, I mean, at, at least it gives me the benefit of having more armor now. And then this is the final battle. The real deal. Ouch. Let's just sit in a corner where it's harder for them to get to me. Maybe they'll hit fight with some. <laughs> I don't know. I lost my train of thought. I ain't afraid to admit it. I ain't got no money. I ain't got no money. Oh! Ooh! <laughs> Scared gamer noises. <laughs> oh my god. And then there's another guy in here. Yeah. I see you. Don't even pretend like you're not there. Take a celebratory sip of water. Is this the final level? No. Get in there though. Ah, shit. Ah, fuck.
I'm just glad there aren't any lost souls in this chapter. That is uh, something that makes me happy. And if there are lost souls, um, fuck me, I guess. Ow. Cut that out. Cut that out. And two hit scanners. I guess I don't get that health then. <laughs> I only rented that health. I don't really get it. Uh. Uh. So I kicked a good chamber. This one is not even swastika shaped. Not even remotely swastika shaped. The uh, the other room that I was t uh, joking about earlier. Oh no! The soy cake ticket chamber um, was actually originally supposed to be a swastika in reference to uh, Wolfenstein 3D. Uh, a reference in really just poor taste, honestly. <laughs> like. Yeah, I know what we'll do. We'll put a swastika in our game because our other game was about killing Nazis. That's a good idea. Hey, hey, hey! Go get for my breakfast. Hold that pistol. Amber Dextrous Z Z Z Tentacium Get away from me! Get away from me, you salty bigaroonies! Ow! Salty fucking scribe! Oh. I don't know what a squab is, to be honest, but I, I called him a salty fucking one. Sorry, I don't know what squab is to be honest. Ship snizzle. Not sure what a ship snizzle is to be honest. <laughs> it's like <laughs> what the fuck? Uh is it squib something from Harry Potter or something? Oh yeah, this guy can't do magic. I know what we call him. We call him a squib. What the fuck? How did how did uh, J.K. Rowling even come up with that shit? I mean, yeah, it's creative, sure, but it's also dumbass. That's who? Why would you call someone a squib? Like, how does that start? What's the wizard etymology of that? Oh, there is none. J.K. Rowling sat there for a minute, it's like, uh, What should they call the people that are wizard but can't do the wizard thing? Hmm, let me think about that with my brain. I know, how about squib? <laughs> the J.K. Rowling goes and makes a billion dollars. Ah! Oh, they all love me! <laughs> uh, they shoot me from all the way over there? Ah, oh, come on. Disrespect. Oh. 
you scared me. You gave me quite a fright there, I must say. Really could use some health, but eh, beggars can't be choosers. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Whenever you find a babe in doom. I'm sorry, you beautiful babe. I don't want to have to kill you, but I must put you out of your misery. <laughs> babe killed. <laughs> babe rescued. That's the N64 version. The N64 version is for lame people. Whereas the N64 version of Gauntlet is for 13 inch cock having chads. Don't think I forgot that. Don't you think for even a moment that I forgot how I said 0% secrets beautiful. How I said that anybody who plays um, Gauntlet Legends for the N64 is a 13 inch cock owning Giga Chad. Don't even forget that for a second. Damn it, just die. Why won't you die? I fought one crabs bit more fearsome than you. Hmm, hmm. Hmm. Oh no. It's a satanic bizarre. Oh my goodness, God. Jesus, thank you, Christ. There's a freaky frack! A patty whack! Yeah, let's take this armor. Uh. Let's get shotgun ammo. Oh no! Stop biting me! Stop biting me right this instant! I don't want you to bite me! <laughs> <laughs> It's not even that funny. All right, we're here. Oh no, what? What the fuck? Oh, oh shit. Oh shit. They're in fighting, they're in fighting, good, okay. How's that going? Oh, he killed him, okay. I one time played uh, Doom 2016 with my sister Jordan, and uh, so for the record, she's a lesbian, and the first thing that she said about it was that it was the gayest game she'd ever seen. <laughs> That's really... Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> I'm showing you this cool game that I have on my Nintendo Switch, and you just disrespect it like that. <laughs> She literally, that's the first thing she says. She's like, oh, this is the gayest game I've ever seen. I'm like, what was that supposed to mean, huh? <laughs> and then she goes on to play it, and she's like, oh, wow, this game's actually pretty cool. Like, <laughs> like there's a part at the beginning where he smacks the computer screen, and he, uh, cocks his shotgun. She's like, that's pretty cool. <laughs> she's the first thing she said in front of us. This is the gayest game I've ever seen. <laughs> so on that high note, this is how we end, uh, chapter one. <laughs> Thank you.
Anyway, yeah. That's chapter one. Once you beat the big badasses and clean out the moon base, you're supposed to win, aren't you? Aren't you? Where's your fat reward and ticket home? What the hell is this? It's not supposed to end this way. It stinks like rotten meat, but it looks like you've lost the Demos base. Looks like you're stuck on the shores of hell. It's the only way is out, out is through. To continue the Doom experience, play The Shores of Hell and its amazing sequel, Inferno.